Hey everyone, I welcome you all to this session. So I have recently posted a video on my YouTube channel in which I discussed about uh, catchfire.org. Basically that's a platform where data analytics interns or uh, data analysts can find volunteer opportunities for themselves and they can enhance their skills and at the same time they can uh, help the NGOs as well, right? So there's a similar kind of platform uh, that is volunteermatch.org and this is the website that you can see I've opened it and the link to this website I'll provide it in the description box below so no need to worry about that uh, but as you all know that uh, for, for all those people who have recently transitioned into the data industry or are beginners or freshers as you already know that uh, it's a bit difficult to get interview calls and to uh, get started so these kind of platforms can give you a good start and it can be very helpful for you because as I have already repeatedly kept on saying in my videos that the best way to learn data analytics is to get your hands dirty with the data. So these kind of platforms can provide you such sort of opportunities and it may certainly help you in, it will certainly help you in enhancing your profile, right? So uh, you can regularly check for different kinds of jobs on these type of platforms. So today we are going to discuss about volunteermatch.org. So here you can see that I have selected virtual and here I have written data analyst and here I have selected relevance. So here we have relevance, event date, date posted, most popular. I've selected relevance and here you can see that there are different opportunities which are available. That is the first opportunities for a data analyst. Then we have AI data analyst virtual internship, then we have data analyst intern, then here we have data analyst and GA4 specialist. So what you have to do is you can just simply click here on this link. And this is how uh, it, it will show you a web page will open where you can see all the details right of that particular job. So you can read this entire description, right? Once you have gone through the description, even if there are 50 to 60 percent of the things in this job description that you are aware of that you know about then you should at least apply for that role right if they like your profile then they can further give you the work as well so they can offer you the opportunity as well so that can certainly be very helpful for you so you should at least apply for these opportunities and you should regularly check these platforms right that's the thing and if you think that this is the opportunity, any given opportunity is the opportunity that you should apply for, then you can just simply click here on I want to help. They will ask you for some basic information or details, whatever details they ask, like the phone number or let's say the email address, you have to provide all the details. And uh, that's it. If then they will share your profile with that particular NGO. If that NGO likes your profile or they want to discuss with you, then they will uh, contact you and uh, if they offer you the opportunity then you will certainly get good experience from there so it can be very beneficial for you now let's talk about uh, another opportunity let's open this opportunity that is data analyst and turn so in this manner you can read uh, all entire job description or whatever description is given you can read it from here and you can actually know about the organization as well, right? So in this manner, they will provide you all the details. So you can know about the organization as well, their mission, the description and rest all the details, right? You can read each and everything from here. So uh, these type of platforms can be very helpful for you in creating a good profile. You can help them as well. And in the, in this manner, you will also be helped, right? So, I think that you should at least apply for opportunities on these type of platforms and you should continuously keep on checking for relevant opportunities on these type of platforms, right? So that's all that I have to say uh, this session. I hope this uh, session was helpful. We'll meet in the next session. Till then, thank you. Bye-bye.